Hello guys, here I am again with a new review. If you are looking for a cheap and reliable smartphone that also offers a great design, iPhone like in this case, which offers you the possibility of up to 16 gigabytes of RAM and all this for a little more than $100, be sure to check out this UFO Note 16 Pro video review. This time the well-known brand of robust smartphones, Yulophone, offered us an ordinary smartphone for review. I can tell you right away, you could also say that this is Xiaomi Poco Killer, best buy in this field of cheap smartphones. So let's start with the boxing. Up at the top is our UFO Note 16 Pro, we will put it aside for a bit. Up there is a pin for opening a SIM slot. Here we have a Note 16 Pro quick guide which is nicely printed in a color, warranty card and other paperwork. Below we find this transparent silicone protective case which additionally protects your phone from scratches and bumps. What else do we find at the box? There is USB Type-C charging cable for charging and data transfer. And finally one standard 10 watt charger. Ok, now that we have checked all the content of this sales package, we can move to our Note 16 Pro smartphone. As I said at the beginning, and as you can see for ourselves, this smartphone comes with a design that is reminiscent of the iPhone in many ways, with its beautiful made black surface and flat edges. This Note 16 Pro comes in two other colors besides this one, which is a Serenity Blue, Midnight Violet and Meteorite Black, the color we have today in the review. This smartphone is quite light, only 184 gram with a thickness of 8.7 mm, which is excellent for fit well in in the hand. On the right side of the frame, which is a flat, there is a perforate volume button and below it we have this power button, which also has a frequent reader, which can be pressed comfortably when we are holding the phone. On the left side we only have the SIM tray for inserting up to 4G compatible SIM cards and uh, one SIM and the microSD memory card. On the button side of the phone we find a 3.5mm headphone jack, microphone, USB Type-C port for charging and a grill under which is a speaker. From the front we have this screen that is nice and big, but it's not too big, it is just the right size. It is a 6.52 inches IPS HD plus 720 by 1600 pixels and has a refresh rate of 16Hz. Up in the t notch we find a very good 8 megapixel Sony selfie camera with the face unlock function. The view of the display is really good, everything is very sharp and the colors came out very well. The black color is well defined. While this may not to be an absolute best option available in the current mobile market, it offers more than sufficient capabilities for social networking and enjoying multimedia content with a commendable quality. As you can see, YouTube videos are doing really well. Considering its price point, this is a truly remarkable phone. The Note 16 Pro incorporates two cameras of total of the three sensors. Its rear camera is made up to 50 megapixel main Samsung sensor and the two macro sensor for close focus. In addition, it's accompanied by large LED flash. It makes good photos, although it's obviously not up to the standards of more expensive smartphones. When there is enough light, the 50 megapixel of its camera is, is noticeable, it makes to capture many details in automatic mode without problems. It's capable of taking high resolution photos where even the most distant details can be appreciated. It can record videos in a resolution of uh, 1080 pixels and 33 fps. In the gallery that follows you can see some photos and video samples that we have taken with Note 16 Pro in different conditions. Well, let's take a look.
The Ulfo Note 16 Pro mounts the Unisoc T1606 with the 8 cores manufactured with a 12 nanometer process. This processor is equivalent to Qualcomm Snapdragon 662. It is an excellent processor and provides excellent performance in daily tasks behind a compromise by the 8 GB of RAM and 120 GB of internal storage. It brings more than enough space to install all the apps and games for use. Its RAM memory can be virtually expanded with up to 8GB of RAM so that you can get a smartphone with a total of 16GB of RAM and the difference in performance with this virtual RAM enabled is very noticeable. Its storage on the other hand can be further expanded by microSD card. Mobile browsing is not very fluid but is acceptable for this price range. You can use any social media app on it and message that you want without problems and it even possible to play some games that you are not very demanding. One of the most interesting things about this phone, it comes with the Android 13, the latest version of Google's operating system, and it comes with all the latest Google fancy features, besides it does not include bloatware advertising or unnecessary apps, thus offering a pure Android experience. Its interface is very clean and simple, which makes it very easy for anyone to use. The phone supports all 4G networks and support for Volt E HD call, with its 4400 mAh battery, the phone offers a range of between a day and a half to two days with normal use. Your phone promises 24 hours of talking time on this phone, 30 hours of TikTok if you prefer it, and 277 hours of standby. As I mentioned at the beginning, there is many cheap smartphones on the market, although Xiaomi's are usually the best options due to their balanced quality price ratio, however, the company's phones have a problem and it's their customization layer MIUI that brings bloatwares and a lot of things that nobody needs and ruin the experience. So if you want the cheap Android that offers you a simple and minimalistic experience like the Google Pixel, then it is the best to avoid Xiaomi and the other similar brands. So what options are we left? Nokia and Motorola also have excellent low-end phones, but their prices are very high. So we are lucky we found this Ulefo Note 16 Pro that is cheap and a simple phone with all this function you need from the latest Android, with no pretense of annoying stuff. It does not work as smoothly as other more expensive phones, its screen is not very bright as in general, but we did not expect that it's this price range. However, there is nothing that seems like a problem for me either. Its camera takes high quality photos when there is a good light. Its battery offers a good duration and this, its design is very economic. And you have to admit that it's very pleasing to eye. It currently costs just over a hundred dollars and in return you get a decent good looking smartphone. The smartphone is ideal as a second device for smartphone beginners and for everyone who does not want to spend a lot of money on new smartphone. So the official sales links are below this video. Be sure to visit them and get your new Yulfon Note 16 Pro today because now is the chance. That will be all for now. Be sure to subscribe and see you soon with some new video review. Bye.